Okay, here, we're going to... I started out making this as a video to show this one off, and it's got the Panasonic on the strap, and here's the only other strapped radio I have in this size. I do have a bigger one that has a strap, but this video is primarily about <coughs> the little radios. Okay, so that's what it looks like there, there, and here, and there's a tune end, and that's it. So, and then here is, like I said, this one here, and this has a... Uh, power input and headphone jack and that's about it and it's your basic functions on top okay <clears throat> all right and it's um you know battery compartment in the back and like that okay i already showed that okay. so then um the next one that i was trying to figure out here is it <clears throat> this is the fm14 so here is a fm uh 25 okay. so there's the fm25 and uh, I don't know where that is, but I'll find it someday. And it, it just has a basic, you know, headphone jack, just like the FM14 does. And it's, uh, basic functions. Okay. All right. So then, then we have a. Um, here's an FM30, and this one here looks like that, and somewhat better functions. It's got ambience. Okay. And this has again just your basic, like that right there. Okay. And <clears throat> there's a tune knob, and this one here takes uh, D batteries, okay, like the FM14 does, but the the FM25 uh, takes oh, I can't remember. I think it takes C batteries. Anyway, then um, then here's an FM33, uh, okay, and it's a dual cassette, and looks like that on top, <clears throat> okay, and uh, takes batteries and uh, it has whoa has line in okay so there you go and then here's the the tune end okay and if I didn't show it real well but there it is you can just pause it okay great and then this one here is not really a this is a national Panasonic but I just thought I'd bring it out here since it's about the same size as the rest of these here okay and it looks like that here and there and it's fully featured for mp3 or whatever and it's uh, got ambience and there's the, the top front there we go okay great so all right so so much for that like I said I brought this out here primarily for this one here now let me and these are all FM's uh, Panasonic's now let me rotate over here and these are uh, F's by Panasonic. Okay, so here is an F by Panasonic. There we go. And then uh, this keys broke off, but they still work. Basic features. Okay. And looks like that on the end. Looks like this on the end. Okay, great. And then this takes. Well, it takes batteries, I'm sure. Anyhow. Okay. And then we have a that's an F2. And then we have the famous F4, okay, and it has uh, your preset equalization deals, okay, and it has headphone jack or microphone, or, 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 anyway, that like that, like that, the tune end, okay, and in the back it's, just, you know, takes batteries, okay, great. Then we have an F5, which I finally found my massage tape. Here's my massage tape I was playing, but I'm not going to play in this video. Let's put it back in there and see. All right. And this one has um, these basic functions here. Okay. It's got line in. Yahoo. So there's a full, complete line in setup. Okay. And your, your tune end. Okay. And that's the F5. Right. Then we have a uh, F20 here, which is really in demand by a lot of people. This one's missing the antenna. I don't know where it is. Maybe it didn't come with one. I don't remember. But it looks like that and looks like that in the back. Okay, and it's got like this on top. Okay. Alright, so then and then um let's see, let me move back a radio or two. 
My particular favorite radio that I like is this Sanyo here, M7770K, and I just brought it out here because it's fully featured on the end, and looks like this on the top. Okay, great. And then, uh, and then here's another, here's a little tiny Sanyo that I have here that I think I left batteries in it. Yep, I did. Okay. And it looks like that on top. Okay. And this plays a cassette. And it has these features on the end. Okay. And it looks like that there. Alright. And then, because I'll never see this one here again, here is once again the, uh, <coughs> the Iowa CS230. Okay. And it, uh, okay. anyway, there's that end. And here's the end that um, <coughs> I repaired, as you can see. Okay. <coughs> anyway, and it, uh, anyway. So there, that, that's the I was uh, on this one. Let me show the top of this one real quick. forgot to do that. You got the um, line in and auxiliary in and all that. Okay. All right, great. So, <coughs> back to the... FM 14 is a radio that only has a strap on the top of it. It's your basic radio, but it plays, it works. Um, that's about it. So let me just and I just put it put all these out here because they're all kind of sonic except for the Iowa, the Sanyo, and the GE. And let me raise it up and give you. A, actually, let me just take it off the tripod and give you a real quick view of all the tops of them. There we go. Alright, so I'm trying to say so. Alright. There we go. That's all of these here and like that as I have them laid out here and hopefully you've enjoyed my little comparison of these uh, what I prefer to call loaf of red sized boom boxes. Have a good one. Bye-bye.